What we are introduced here in the Balanced View Training is something really powerful. <coughs> we are introduced to using our intelligence in the most beneficial way, in the most powerful way. We all, we all um, have so much power and potential as human beings and most people haven't known about how to use this power and this potential. At least I had no idea. I knew always that I, I was powerful in a way, but I couldn't access it in that way that I wanted to. And now I, I came to this training and I was introduced to something, how I can use my intelligence in the most powerful and effective way. And, and, and that was really mind-blowing for me, because it was so simple. It was so simple in a way, because I, I saw that I don't need to do anything with my thoughts, emotions and sensations and experience, everything that I perceived. I didn't need to do anything with them anymore. I was so used to um, trying to rearrange all my, my um, data streams. So data streams is everything that we can perceive, so all our emotions and thoughts. Always trying to rearrange them in a way that I felt comfortable, that I had, or that I thought I would feel comfortable, or that I had um, the most well-being. Rearranging my circumstances in a way that I feel, feel good. And it never really worked. It may, may, might work for a little time, but it never really worked f like always, that I felt comfortable in all situations, because I had so much, I had to put so much energy and effort into that rearranging of my thoughts, trying to make them positive, or trying to put myself in circumstances that I would feel well. And now I was introduced to um, a way of being where I was, I could live a happy life regardless of the circumstances I'm in, regardless um, what I was thinking, regardless what I was feeling. I was introduced to something about me that was always stable, always had complete life satisfaction and, and fulfillment at all times. To that ground of being that is always present, that we call open intelligence. It's our power to know, our power to um, experience life to the fullest. And to, to be introduced to that about ourselves allows us to really tap into the, the um, yeah, it allows us to tap into um, our potential as human beings, to really see clearly how we want to live our lives that is of most benefit. And we do that simply by relaxing for short moments many times, repeated many times, resting deeply in the power of open intelligence. And we do that by um, just r resting the mind and body completely for a split second. We stop the train of thought that is going on now, maybe in our head. We stop there, right there. And we, we um, perceive this stability, this present that is always there, that that perceives, that that knows, that that hears everything I am saying now, that that sees everything that is going on here. We relax deeply, we rest deeply into that for a split second. And we can test that out during our day to day, repeating that, that just that split second of recognition that there's a stability about us that is always there, that never goes anywhere, that just got unnoticed because we, we um, focused or we put all our attention into all our thoughts and emotions, how we feel, what we think. So we, we, this, this presence and this um, stability just got, gets unnoticed. But it's always there, always there, same. We don't need to try to achieve it or make it more. Open intelligence is always present, fuels everything that we can perceive, all our thoughts, emotions, sensations, experiences. And by allowing everything to be as it is, all our, our emotions, all our thoughts, we tap into that intelligence that has gone unnoticed, and then we see completely clear in all situations. We feel completely fine and safe in all situations, no matter where we are. Are we in our jobs at home? Are we here in Goa? Or are we somewhere else? It doesn't matter. This stability is always within us, always present always there, always um, available for us to tap into. And this in intelligence that is always present, this open intelligence, 
we can tap into in every moment of our lives. Always. It never gone anywhere. And, and in that way we completely upgrade um, the way how we use our intelligence. It's a complete upgrade from the former ways we've used our mind. The former way of how we perceived our things. A complete upgrade. Like I, I upgraded my phone recently. I got an iPhone and and I had this most basic phone. You couldn't. You could just call. I mean, it, it did its job in a way. And then I decided to upgrade to an iPhone. And wow, what amazing options I have now! You know, I can do all kinds of things, and it's so effective for what I need to do. It just helps me completely to organize everything I need to do for my work. And it, it's just. I don't want to go back anymore. And that's the same with our intelligence, with the open intelligence. We completely upgrade to something that is so effective and efficient in every moment of our life. And I can choose to use my old phone or I can choose not to. And, and it's so amazing because we have now everything available, what we want to, and then we can choose clearly. That's how our um, intelligence is. But wide open, seeing everything clearly, having all the options available and then we choose from there. Completely clear. Upgrading our intelligence, as simple as that. Knowing how to use our mind in the most beneficial way. Not limiting ourselves to, to something that is not as effective. When we hone into all our data streams of anger, or of sadness, of joy or whatever it is, we, we just limit ourselves completely. Just that's what we see. Where we hone into, our, where we put our attention, that's what we see. When we keep it wide open and spacious, then that's what we see. Like on the top of the mountain, we see everything clearly. We have such a great view from there. We see everything clearly. And, and from down, we don't see everything clearly when we hone into a data stream, a thought emotion. So we don't want to act out of any of our emotions and thoughts. They don't have any meaning in and of themselves. They arise as that magical display of open intelligence and nothing else. We don't want to have that inform our actions in any way. We want something to inform our action that is potent and powerful and stable at all times. Always beneficial. And that's what we tap into when we relax deeply there. Resting deeply in our, in our great powers, we are also powerful and have so much potential to be of benefit, to, to relate in a way that is most beneficial. Everyone, no matter who it is. And, and, and to open up to that, it's a, a complete joy in every moment. I feel like every moment of my life just gets better and better. I feel more easeful every every moment of my life. Every time I come back to India, I feel more relaxed and easeful. I feel more potent and powerful. I feel so comfortable in my own skin. It's amazing. And it is just ever growing. And now I think I feel completely comfortable. I thought the same thing last year, but now I feel so much more comfortable. It's just always growing and it's so amazing. And that's, that's the experience for everyone. You know, it's not just some people or, or some people um, don't, don't have that or anything like that. Everyone. We are all so powerful human beings and we all um, can live a life of full life satisfaction and, and, and uh, flourishing and, and complete empowerment in every moment. And it's, it's yeah, it's so natural, the, the, the feeling of wanting to be liked and it yeah, we could all see everybody almost put their hands up and, and it's so natural to, to um, yeah, we all want to belong and we all want to be liked and, and, and it's so sad that, that, it, that we all not live in a world that everybody can feel like completely respected and completely hon honored in all areas of their lives. And that's what drives me always to share more and more this training because I can see that now for, for myself and for, for, for others, a life where we can completely outshone all our data streams, where we are completely connected with each and every one, no matter what thought we have. Even if we have a thought about someone, it doesn't matter. 
we are completely connected and as open intelligence there, complete opening up to everyone, no matter the background, no matter where he's coming from, or no matter what it is, complete openness and heart connection. I feel so connected to everyone, even people I don't know. Formerly I thought I would need to know everyone completely. I would know, need to know all the, their data streams, I need to know everything to feel connected to a person. It, I thought it takes me always a couple of years to get really warm with, you know, like all these kinds of ideas. And now I don't even, I meet someone and I just feel that heart connection, just as, as human beings and with everyone and everything. And that's really the beauty of, of our lives and we are all meant to live like that. We are not meant to live like hating each other or criticizing each other or being nasty to each other. No, we are all meant to be living harmoniously together. And that's what we are introduced here, that there's really a way that this is possible.